Suspicious shaking, rattling homes and nerves. Tonight, people living in one Valley neighborhood are on edge. They want to know what caused their homes to shake today. Many saying it felt like an earthquake. Team Charles Rachel Cole joins us live from our two key where people felt that shaking. Rachel. Yeah, good evening to you guys. People describing that movement in all sorts of ways, but experts tell us there was no sizable earthquake recorded, but Arizona does have more shakes and quakes than you might expect. Just kind of like a rumbling that made the house move a little bit. I don't know what the hell it was, but it hit my roof. Something hit the roof. I wasn't sure what it was. I came out, looked, there was nothing there. I was walking into my kitchen area and all of a sudden there was a, a boom that rattled the windows, just like a sonic boom. People living near 17th Avenue and Chandler in Ahwatukee describing what they felt. But sometimes big semis going by fast make that happen, but there was nothing out there. 1245, I was talking to my husband and I said, did you hear that? I said, something hit the roof. And as soon as I hung up with him, I came out and looked. There was nothing there. Within Arizona, we probably see somewhere between 50 and 100 earthquakes originating. But Michael Conway, senior research scientist at the Arizona Geological Survey at U of A, says it's unlikely they can be felt. Once a year, twice a year, we're going to see magnitude 3 through magnitude 4, magnitude 5 events occurring. However, the Arizona Geological Survey has about 15 seismometers across the state and says an earthquake wasn't recorded. So if there was some shaking in the area, I, I suspect we should have picked it up. But he says it doesn't discount that so many people felt something shake. Just may not have been a quake. It only lasted maybe five seconds, if that. It was quick. It was not long enough to make me think it was an earthquake. It was more, more of a an air impact on the window or or like a big bird hit the side of the house. Pretty specific descriptions there from those people who live in the area. And you know what? Even though there wasn't an earthquake recorded, Conway says those people who felt it should record the date and time and send that data to the geological survey so it can continue to be tracked. We're live in Ahwatukee tonight. Rachel Cole, 12 News at 10.